Hi, family. So I want to show you a quick how to on how your students can get into their G Suite for Columbus City Schools. Now, it does not matter if you're using a Chrome browser, a Safari, Internet Explorer, or Firefox. It doesn't matter. I currently have Chrome up and you can see that I've signed out of everything. The first thing you're going to want to do is go to google.com. So when you get here, you'll see that there's this side that says sign in now. So you know, we do not have access to Gmail. The students do have an Outlook email, but they do not have Gmail. So you will not be able to use that. But you're gonna wanna click sign in, okay? And I'm gonna say use another account so you can see. Now your students will not have this, but they will have a number. Typically it's a seven digit number. It is their student ID. You must make sure that they are putting in, ooh, well, see, you need to make sure that they are putting in columbus.k12.oh.us, okay? Once they've done that, they'll click next. And now their password is going to be their birthday. It is their two digit month, hyphen, two digit day, hyphen, and their four digit year. Then you will click next. And apparently my password has changed. So, there we go. All right, so once you get here, you will see that you have this, what we call a waffle. When you click on that, you will see all these different apps. The students have access to those. And you will see that one of the first ones they can see is Classroom. They are all connected. All they have to do is click on Classroom and it will take them to their classroom. Now I am part of multiple classrooms. They might be as well, just depending, but this is our particular one for our class. So they will want to click on fifth grade. 2019, 2020, and they will see our classroom. This is where they can see things that are due today, things that are coming up, our posting about class meeting and any other material. So this is their main place to find their information. If you need any other assistance with this particular part of G Suite or having them access these things, please let me know. But otherwise, I hope this helps.